Jamie Bates, everyone bar Benstead in the city half. Jones fix it on, Cadet might run for Holsworth, but in fact it was swept back by, I think it was Robbie James there, back to Tomlinson. Still neither keepers really have a save to make. It's flicked on by Reed. That's going to be a goal kick. and Duxby was definitely offside Bab wasn't but Duxby going into an offside position and another Brentford free kick Evans Holdsworth beaten there Bates loses out to Bab but Rostrum wins it back Evans looks for Gale nice flick on by Gale but uh, couldn't get the right direction on it and safely with Tomlinson Crowd on the new roadside trying to lift the bees. Evans, Jones, Jewel. Not a good ball by Paul Jewel there. Cadet. This is Reed. Ball forward from Sinnott, but. Uh, fairly aimless so not a lot happening in this game at the moment James Bab takes it out Jimmy Carstairs Gale Cadet wins it, but uh, kept in there by, I think it was Sinnott on the far side. Carstairs, James, Evans, James again. Players in two lines either side of the centre circle. Ratcliffe, Jones, Jones and Reed, and Reed comes away with it. Finds Jewel. Tinian going on the overlap. Evans is there though. Jewel. Tinian. And I think it's gone out for a goal kick. Just kept it in on uh, the touchline, saved the throw, but couldn't save the goal kick. Holdsworth beaten again there. Evans knocks it back to Benston. Duxby, but uh, Bab was offside. Bates, Bab, looking for McCarthy, forward by James, but Duxby's offside. The rain teeming down here at Griffin Park. Chilly afternoon. Cadet. Ratcliffe. Bradford City fans running for cover at that far end.
Jones. Cadet. Babb. Evans wins it. Godfrey. But Jones have moved. Reed. Godfrey wins it back. Jones. Tinian. Comes to Torpy. Evans with him. Rostron wins the tackle. Well played by Will Rostron. Carstairs has a bit of a chase. Holdsworth beats Oliver this time, but uh, can't keep his feet. Four by James. Ratcliffe, good header. Ratcliffe again. Gale. Tackle by James. Evans. Holdsworth. Played by Dean Holdsworth. Still Holdsworth. Godfrey should have given it back to Holdsworth. Jones. And a goal! I think it's Lee Sinnott. It might be Gavin Oliver, in fact. But it doesn't matter for Brentford because they're level. Keith Jones played the ball in. It hit the City defender. And 27 minutes gone. It's Brentford 1, Bradford City 1. Holdsworth made the run. He found Kevin Godfrey. He, instead of playing it back to him, played it to Keith Jones. And I think his cross went in off Oliver. So, maybe that's a bit of luck Brentford needs. Godfrey. Jewel. Foul by Cadet. Free kick. So, City straight back on the attack. It's Brian Tinian with the kick. Corner off Gale. City's first of the game. Here comes the corner, cleared by Bates. Four by Jewel Cadet. Tackled by Duxbury. And James knocks it back. We're voting for Oliver for that goal. And another Brentford free kick. So maybe Brentford further rain and referee not happy. Kicks can be retaken. Gale wins the corner and. Uh, Sinnott not very happy about that. Almost reached the half hour mark. It's Brentford's second corner. Keith Jones with it. Rackley flicks on Evans! Terry Evans! The near post corner. They've tried it so often in recent away games. And this time it's produced the goal. Evans second of the season. Brentford two, Bradford City one. And at last, Terry Evans has scored with his head this season. Every set piece goes to his head. He's only scored once before with his feet at Sheffield Wednesday, but this time he's done it. And suddenly, within four minutes, Brentford turned this game around. Jones took the corner, Ratcliffe headed on at the near post, as he's done so often in recent weeks. And Evans stole in to head home from inside the six-yard box. And those fans delighted.
Those near post corners are so difficult to defend against and Ratcliffe's been so good at getting them and Brentford profited. Holdsworth, Duxbury, Bab, Jewel, Jewel takes it himself, and look, could be a foul by Evans, yes. I don't really think he can object about that. So, about 10 minutes ago, this game is drifting along, drifting along aimlessly. It's really come to life now. Might be a crack from Robbie James here, number two. Tinney in the left backs there as well. Reed over the ball. Tinian. Goal kick. Tinian scored twice last Saturday went in City's 4 0 win over Orient. Not on that occasion. Keith Jones, captain this side, he's had a superb season, Jones. Ratcliffe. Ev all the players, both teams came in the throw, and it goes to City. I think Simon Ratcliffe had more of a case there, but anyway, it's Tinian to take it. Evans, and Jones can't keep it in. Tinian, Bab, Rostron back helping out, Gale, four by Oliver, Torpy, should be Benstead's, and it is. Holdsworth wins it, Cadet, Holdsworth goes for the return, but just too far ahead of him. Nice play from Cadet and Holdsworth there. Holdsworth won the header against Oliver. He's lost, hadn't won many of them so far this afternoon. Set up Cadet, Cadet's return ball, couldn't quite reach him. And now at the other end, game really livening up. Ratcliffe. Godfrey. He's in at the moment for the injured Neil Smiley. Jones, forward by Ratcliffe. Cadet beats Sinnott. Still Cadet. And looked for Rostrum, but he wasn't there. The cadet didn't really look when he played that pass, and it's back with Tomlinson. The rain seems to have uh, died down quite a bit. In fact, it may have stopped. Holdsworth almost gets that kick. But Gale now. Cadet in the middle. Almost through to Holdsworth, cleared by Oliver. Rostrum wins it back. Gale. No one there except Jewel. Evans. Gale. Oliver. Cadet. Still looking for that home goal, Richard Cadet. Couldn't get it there. He's really, his form has uh, really improved the last two months. He'd been on the list, he hadn't been in the team, he got back in the team in December and he's been playing well. <laughs> so Robbie Jones with his kick. Close from Torpy. The kick came in, it was headed on by Oliver, and Torpy headed just over. So, City showing that by no means out of this game.
City free kick, foul by Holdsworth. Evans and Torpy comes to Ratcliffe. Tinian, Jones, Holdsworth, nice turn, but couldn't keep his balance. Might run for Godfrey though. Good ball from Godfrey, just ahead of Cadet, and helped out by James. Gale's with him, and Gale wins it. But James tackles him, and it's going to be a Brentford throw. City fans not happy. Carstairs, back to Bates. Still Bates, Jones, tackle by Reed. Bab finds Torpy and can't control it. But Evans, a judge, still pushed him off there. I think it was a, a uh, nothing in that challenge, but since he got the free kick. Bates, Jewel, Bates again, good tackle, only comes to Tinian, offside against the whole City forward line. Cadet. Foul on Cadet, free kick. Evans comes up again. It's going to be Rostrum with it. Evans. Ratcliffe, and foul on Godfrey, another free kick. So Godfrey leaves it for Rostron again. And Gale! So close, it just needed a sl slight diversion from Marcus Gale there, and it would have been 3-1. Good curling free kick from Wilf Rostrum. Bates. Holdsworth slips. Bates again. Back to Benstead. Five and a half minutes to half time. Flick on by Gale, looked like a sandwich on him, but uh, comes to Godfrey. Ratcliffe. Poor ball intercepted by Reed. And Keith Jones is down. They should stop play because it looks like a head injury. Surely the referee should stop, and Cadet kicks it out quite rightly. Along comes Roy Clare for the second time in the game. So Jones recovers, and uh, we'll see if City are going to throw the ball back to Brentford. They are, very sporting. Ratcliffe back to Benson. Good to see that in football now. Even though the ball has ended up in Brentford's half of the field, when they were on the attack. Foul by Godfrey, free kick. Godfrey smiles about it.
Blackcliffe. Chul. Rostron. Oh, well played now, Gale. Cadets up with him. Still Gale. Still Gale. Against the bowling cadets. Rostron. Holdsworth. Jones. 3 1. What a marvellous goal from Brentford. From one end of the field to the other. It's Keith Jones' 10th of the season. 42 minutes gone. Brentford 3. Bradford City 1. Started in Brentford's own half, Will Froston set Marcus Gale free. He ran up to the city area, had a tussle with Lee Sinnott, finally got the ball across to Richard Cadet. It went from him to Dean Holdsworth to Keith Jones, and Jones stuck it away. Brentford three, Bradford City one. And in quarter of an hour, Brentford have turned this game round from being 1 0 down to being 3 1 up. Evans and Ratcliffe. Ratcliffe's gone down, he's holding his head. Cadet didn't mean to kick it out, but uh, did nevertheless. And Roy Clare is back in the action once more. So Ratcliffe recovers. Jewel. Goal kick. Not going for City at the moment. Benstead. We're having all sorts of weather now. Glorious sunshine suddenly. Kevin Godfrey. Has Brentford's football brought the sunshine out? Ratcliffe. Holdsworth. There's an arm across his throat there. Torpy. Jewel. Evans. Finds Gale. Well played by Gale. He beats James. Still Gale. Good tackle by Oliver in the end. James looks for Bab. Bates is there and it's back with Benston. We're playing injury time now. There should be about two or three minutes of that. Blackcliffe. Torpy. Straight to Rostrum. Jones. Looks for Cadet. Sinnott with him. Sinnott does well, but only gives it to Rostron. Godfrey. Holdsworth. Jones. Uh, Cadet. Campbell. Free kick. Torpy, McCarthy, goal kick. 